hello guys welcome to my channel and uh, today it's about workout man we need to be staying consistent and how are we going to do that there are so many ways actually but first of all i'll tell you to get ready in case you want to get workout to be done are you available in the morning are you available in the afternoon are you available in the evening if it's in the morning make sure that you don't eat too much be taking good consistent diet a good diet a diet with you know carbs and fiber and less fat we don't need too much carbohydrate you know you need to be strict on it so in case you eat two pieces of bread eat two pieces of bread with flakes eat flakes if you ate eating some little meat little piece of meat then you take a little piece of meat that's how it is people you need to be strict with your diet don't be taking in too much but sufficient so that's number one and uh, if you're going in the evening make sure that you are already cooked or maybe you have some food ready once you come from the gym so that will be really important because i don't think that anyone's going to cook rice at 10 p.m so that's, that's not going to happen anyway and i know for sure that i can't do it because if i go to work and come back late and then go for workout i can cook at 10 p.m when will I be done? Almost midnight. So that's a big no for me. So be mindful of what you eat. And then besides you can plan that you're going for at least three times in a week. So let's say Monday, Wednesday and Friday. If you have planned it, then it will be more easy for you to be consistent to go to the gym. That's how it is. You can't be any more consistent without planning. Because if you don't plan, then you might think, okay, I've gone, I'll go three times, but after it all, it ends up with two, or maybe one, or maybe you don't even go at all. So plan it so that at least you go off into the gym. And then the next thing is try to get a steady body, man, a gym body. You need a gym buddy. Anyone who goes to the gym for, let's say, all the days in the week, or maybe get someone who goes to the gym three times in the week, just like you do, then you can gym together. You can train together, motivate each other. You do five reps, and then that gym buddy will also do five reps. Maybe you will even do six reps. It's challenging. He's your challenger. In case you are not even motivated to go ahead and take a step further, the gym body will be able to help you to go ahead and take a step further. That's how it is, people. The gym body is really important. Without the gym body, I don't really think that you'll be motivated that much because you'll be less motivated because he keeps you company and he'll motivate you that one more, two more, three more, four more, five more, you know, he will keep you updated with everything that you do and, and everything that you do to keep you updated with how many more left or even in case you're supposed to do some bonus reps, he is able to help you to get through it or she. So try to get the gym buddy who is able to help you to do this thing at the gym in case you are not motivated because some people go to the gym more once they have somebody to go with. I am that type and my friends are that type. So we go to the gym together and then we do keep each other motivated. That's it people. And then the last thing to keep some consistent you don't want to get body pains over the whole of your body you want to get 
that say parts of your body train and let the rest rest and then you train that part so let's say today i'm training biceps i'm training tricep and then the next time i go to the gym let's say wednesday then i train stomach and then i train legs and then the next time i go to the gym i train shoulder and then i train back you understand so at least my muscles of the places that i train are not tight because the first day i train bicep and i train tricep second day i take stomach and i train legs my body has time to rest and then the last day i think i train back and i train my shoulder there's no complaint because all the parts of the body are able to rest enough for me to you know put in my all to build the muscles to look muscular you know that is how it is people don't be putting too much effort and training bicep and tricep every day or training legs alone the whole week no you're not gonna look good and nice you need to look attractive and give all the parts of your body equal attention that's how you can stay consistent because you're not overworking the body but you are doing putting in the work actually that your body can handle and that's what's important put in the effort that your body can handle so first of all i will say make sure that you take a good diet and get alarm ready about how many days you are going to go in a week to the gym and get the gym body and make sure that you are actually training the right parts of your body at the day don't train all the body every day just part of it and the other night next part of it the other day other part of it that's how it's gonna be so that's it people i hope that you like this and do subscribe because i do release more videos but this is the end